Today is April 9, 2015. My name is Thomas Gage and the purpose of this video is to publicize my filing of a constitutional criminal complaint. And this constitutional criminal complaint is filed according to the uh, Burr's Law Dictionary, which a criminal complaint is filed with the United States Attorney or United States Magistrate Judge. Since that the United States Attorney General of the District of New Jersey, uh, Paul Fisher, has been refusing to act on my criminal complaint, I decide today, April uh, 9, 2015, to file with the United States Magistrate Judge. And this is what I'm doing. So the judge uh, will, will be served with this complaint is Honorable Tony N. J. Bongiovanni, uh, United States Magistrate Judge, uh, 402 East uh, State Street, Trenton, New Jersey. So, and this is the the sworn complaint. The sworn complaint is a uh, is uh, by laws. The uh, these laws are criminal law uh, under Title 18 USC. Uh, this complaint uh, has one, two, three four pages of uh, title 18 USC criminal code of laws this laws all right and also has uh, uh, some of the Jersey statute laws here which is uh, under title uh, title 2c the New Jersey code of criminal justice which uh, you know such as a uh, perjury uh, false swearing and opinion attaining by fraud and others so this is a uh, goes here and this law is applicable in this case and this is a uh, constitutional criminal complaint the proper cause uh, reason of cause are starting from count one to count 40 four zero so and this is are here uh, one two three four five six seven and eight pages of uh, you know uh, counts you know from one count one to count 40 and it all here and this law as applicable in this case like I said and the evidence that attached with this complaint including with this complaint are uh, tangible uh, forensic evidence so this is really evidence it's not the question about this evidence and they are here listed from a b c d e f g h i and dvd and two dvds okay and this is a my as well as you know this is a as well complaint so assign it and and uh, notarize it okay exhibit a this is a request that I made uh, dated January 24, 2011 to the Sheriff uh, County, Somerset County Sheriff Office. He was supposed to investigate the corruption that was going on with my land at Sleepy Hollow and, uh, and the township of Warren, uh, but he refused to do so. And this is, a, you know, the proof of that. And this is a exhibit B. We have a uh, it's a bit, bit of fraudulent court order uh, right of cell. This uh, court order right of cell, it's a sheriff cell, and uh, and this was done by uh, use of a fraudulent uh, uh, right of execution, which is uh, this execution was never signed by a judge and never was before a judge. Uh, this was uh, done by the attorneys. Uh, you can see the, the the name of the judge was stamped and the and they stamp it with the the signature of the clerk office. Uh, there is no court. This is not by a judge. So the order uh, comes from a judge, not from a court, uh, an alleged uh, superior court office. So this is a, a fraudulent cell. So this was a fraudulent beginning, and this is a bit C. As you can see, it's a sheriff deed. Okay, the sheriff deed is a, a forgery. Okay, the 
this uh, deed, besides the fact there was a uh, under Prateus that there was a knowledge cell, uh, which was fraudulent anyway. There were no, well, basically was no any cell, but they uh, were went forward with this, uh, produced this uh, fraudulent deed, sheriff deed, which is uh, here. This is this signature here, the all uh, forger signature. And when you compare this with the auto office, you you know that the signature they don't match. Okay, and then also with this uh, sale, the sheriff, uh, you know, uh, made uh, nineteen thousand uh, dollars on this fraud on sale. Okay, now this is a uh, SFD, which now we saw that now this is another another uh, chef D, which has nothing to do with that one. So the the signature on this D is completely uh, forged, but different from the other uh, previous D you just saw. So these two D were uh, were produced at a different time and and, and submitted as a court record. So another another crime there. You know we have these laws that you cannot do that. So this 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 signature here, they're all different from the other uh, fraud on these. So there is two D's of a house property, but both are forged. Okay, no no no, those are anything legally done. Okay, so they're all illegal uh, fraudulent uh, uh, fraudulent uh, deeds. So this is going now. This is a uh, again. Exhibit A, Exhibit E, Exhibit E. We have all this uh, signature here. You see the Thomas Miller signature. Uh, this is the auto office of them. So this is the judge. Okay. This is a Frank Provenzano signature here. See this one here, and then you have uh, the General Perez, the the, the clerk office. This is the way she way she signed it. And this was all uh, verified auto office. Uh, this is a the auto office of the chief police warrant, so he has an auto office. Auto office of the surgeon and the police. So this uh, this exhibit F exhibit F is a, a court order of the, it's a, this is a, a court text where it's uh, where I filed a, 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 a default judgment against Chef Granzano because he was sued by me, uh, he personally sued by me. And he, he defaulted, and then there was a pending judgment on it. It's pending judgment on this, uh, uh, and then the, the judge uh, Walson uh, from the District Court of Trenton uh, ordered him to comply with, the, you know, to to give it time him to, you know, comply with the, with the complaint. But uh, in the meantime, he exercised eviction, uh, an illegal eviction. Uh, uh, when the case uh, was spent in court, so by that denied me the due process of law was denied, because when you know it was as it was an appeal about the fraud on the sale himself, but they decided to commit a obstruction of justice, and, you know, and do the crime. That's what proves. Exhibit G, exhibit G, we have a, an alleged court order here. This is a, just a, a fraudulent a fraud a, a forged document. That's supposed to be a court order, which is not at all. Again, a court order must be signed by judge, and then, you know, ordered by judge. Here we have a stamp uh, name of the judge on it, and we have a, a forger, uh, alleged uh, clerk office signature here. And this is the, sh the court order with the sheriff uh, uh, came up uh, to our house and evicted us from our own homes. Uh, with the protest that he had a court order, he said he wasn't there on a court order. You can hear that in the, the filing here uh, on the audio. You can hear that he was said, I'm here on a court order. There was no court order. This is, was never been in court. So that is the crime. Okay. This is again a further document. Okay. Here. And then we got the exhibit. This is exhibit H, which are the document they used to. Foreclosure, and the, uh, well, there was a default foreclosure on default. So, uh, this uh, contain included like a superior court notice of assignment deficiency, a forger robber signer assignment, forger robber signers, a certificate of letters. So, this all this was presented by the, the attorney, which uh, named it here in this um, lawsuit and in this complaint. Uh, and this is uh, 
obviously the court administration uh, ca uh, catch them and they were doing something wrong they stopped them but someone put it through anyway so they you know, someone just uh, went above the law and this is the the father assignment the robot sign the father assignment the date doesn't match with the, with another uh robber sign uh, exhibit i is uh, a uh, correspondence from the uh, chief police, former chief police of Warren Township, which is, uh, you know, to advise me that we stay away from my property. Uh, and he knows uh, that, uh, with the knowledge that my property was stolen, stole it, and then, you know, I'm the only owner of the property. So this is the correspondence that I have with them. So it's on record, they have knowledge of the crime, and they don't think about it. Two, DVDs, two DVDs are this one here. Uh, which I have uh, already in the package here um, are going to be sent, which is a sheriff illegal eviction uh, on August 8, 2011 and sheriff illegal eviction of uh, storage. So these documents are going to be sent today, April 9, 2015 to the magistrate judge, district court of New Jersey and uh, follow up with the this is the core or then so that is uh, now put everything in the package yeah. Yeah. we have the package here this package here, it's just a number here again, there's a sort of a num the register number uh, RE0637669870 USA. I'm going to the post office now and then when I'm back I will uh, put on record the receipt. Look at you taking a picture of this good thing. That though is a nutri, you know. <laughs> I'll put the uh you want the price too? Yeah, put everything. Let's see how okay. let's seal it. Okay. 402 East. Except secondary. Mm. Alright, there isn't one. I don't know. Oh the judge name. Shoot. Yeah, let me start all over. Sorry. Okay. Oh eight six oh eight. $17.90 is going to be your total. Thank you. Here, $20. Okay, $20 cash. Change will be $2.10. 
the tracking number is on your receipt and they will receive this to tomorrow. All right. Tomorrow, right? Tomorrow. Friday the 10th, right? They will receive this on Friday the 10th. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you for your help. Sure. Okay. Thank you. Have a good day. Copy, Mr. Gage, okay? Yes. Anything else here for the children? Uh, yeah. What is that? All right, okay, this is for me. Yeah, it's your copy. You've got one for your wife and then for any uh, adult children. Right? How many adult children do you have with you? Right now, we have uh, Anthony and two. Okay, I'm going to give you all the copies, okay? Yes. And these are copies saying is that they're going to take possession of the property today, okay. right? So, what is that, the court order? It's a court order saying you're going to be taking yeah, who's the judge? judge? Who's the judge? The judge is on there, wherever we're going to take. Let's see. Yeah, give him some time to read it. Okay. Yeah, it is a good one. It's a good one. It's a good one. Okay. Okay. It's a good one. Mr. Gates, the next step of the process will be that we'll just need this vehicle. Yes. Uh, vehicle uh, also, uh, okay. I want to I want to understand my right. No, that's understandable. Please see it, right? right? Right. Any questions you have, right? All right, that, that's what we need. Um, just so you know what we need on our end, though. We uh, need the vehicle. And, and this property here, uh, what's the, the name is here? This here? is the, the Superior Court of Trenton. Okay. Uh, Thomas Gage, yeah, there is a tenant here. There's a thing to build the Finger Builder Corporation. What's that? It's in tenant. It's in tenant. Yeah, the Finger Builder. No, we can't. We can't. You open it wherever you say you have. Okay, okay. all right. You're saying that Thomas Gage yourself is a tenant? No. No, he's, I, he's I'm, a tenant. I'm a, I own some. So I understand, sir. Like you said, that's something that we dealt with, with the attorney. Yeah. All right, so this is, this is a record, so this is a tenant house. That's fine. Yeah. This is a copy of a uh, request for an investigation of corruption warrant that the, the, the sheriff officer refused to do so. And then, and then uh, for the record, the, the, the sheriff is the elected people. Uh, so I, I am one of those who elect them. Yes, sir. That request an investigation of corruption. This is a mere from the corruption. I understand. I mean, he's done many requests. No, 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 like said, any questions you have, we're happy to. to explain. No, yeah. any questions you have, we it's definitely, yeah. all that legal stuff, when it gets well, to any, our point. Any yeah. paper that you guys can provide yeah. that has been no, done that's legally, fine. and that this is, uh, the law would follow. No, I understand. Then he's not, he's not proposing. No, we appreciate that. Like I said, when it gets to this point, right. Emotional, All the you know, attorneys have been involved. Yeah. Uh, very sensitive. It is very sensitive. So, uh, and you know what, it's, what he has to be offered. I understand. But, okay. so, but as long as it's done through, you know, no, through everything goes through the proper law, channels. Yeah. And, no, 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 uh, sure. and it's been done, you know. Oh, also, you're aware there is a federal court. Uh, there's a lawsuit against the sheriff office, and that the sheriff office is defaulting on the federal and court. No, that's that's fine. This, yeah. Uh, all that other stuff is in play. No, I understand. All that stuff is. And I appreciate that. All that stuff is in the legal system. It's a civil matter. Right. Right. But we are here today with this paperwork that we have to execute. So at this point, and the next stage here now. Right. On the and this court, this, this court order, right. this order was issued on the second. That's right. Okay. At this point now, though, what we need is everyone just going to click it online and start moving the cars out, okay? okay. That's where we're at. Also, also, because you are uh, you are uh, an elected lawyer and then you own the, uh, the, the duty of the Constitution of the United States. Yes, sir. I, I want to report to all you testimony here that I have a... Uh, just to receive some fraud to this city here from the township of Warren here. Okay. And this is the this is the this is the, the file I'm gonna give it to you for the investigation. Okay? Uh, it shows that there's a corrupt dish here, right? Okay. Okay? And then sure. you, you you do this investigation like if follow up that too. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. Follow up that too. I mean this, that's this is a copy here. I got the original uh, seat. No, that's fine. Anything you want to give me, I'll take it from you. Yes. Um, this any is questions you have, go to you. Right here. With the, with the right here to investigate it. Okay. Fair so, deal. Uh, okay. 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 Right? Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, okay. everything at this point. Anything that's on here goes to yeah, the yeah. So, so there is a, so there is a, there is, there is material of the infinity builders in this house. That's right, that's right. Let me read this. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's all about the infinity builders. It's almost a conversation. Yeah. Yeah, okay. No, I understand. 
understand. Good. I understand. Like I said, we're so here. I don't know how. No, I know. understand where you're coming. Yeah, um, but we, yeah, we were on a court order to be here, and this is what we have to do. I understand that. I mean, this is the court order. No, no yeah. and you definitely call your attorney and have your attorney. I'm going to present this case here. Yeah. So that's oh, I'll process. Process. okay. Yeah, and then also, I'm still telling you, there is another another lawsuit against the judiciary system that you stay in the federal court, which uh, which against any court order. Okay. So you're aware of that? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. I appreciate that. Let's move these vehicles, please. Okay, move. Yeah, we're gonna uh, get all move, these cars move, in the parking on the street. Yeah, I'm gonna move there. At, at, at. You, gotta, you, gotta, you got all the, the material now from the city of the material. Here. No, it's okay. You got it to put it to my right, right? Yeah, I thought it's okay. No, it's okay. I'm gonna move the car. car. I have some problems here, and I need the help. Okay? They're, they're not supposed to be here because this is a federal court uh, distribution here. And also, I, I provide them with uh, some uh, paper that I, I requested for the court uh, warrant, uh, some of the document that we put to the court, uh, that, that they are out the wrong. So, I have provided to them the investigation. This is a, a strictly okay. county. This is strictly yes, county. Yes, and then uh, they elected like to call office. Nothing to do with us. Yeah, but uh, I'm saying that uh, because I want to talk to you about it. Okay, you're going to have to speak to a supervisor from the sheriff's department. They're the ones okay. that are affecting the warrant. Okay. Uh, and, uh, the, uh, somebody I know, everyone on my right, I have this. And then, and then also I'm attending, the community office is attending at the material in the house. Is, you know, okay. So we, have, so we have to move this spot. That's what we have to do. Was it? Um, with this, we could with this. Um, yeah, road here because this road is not supposed to be like this. Yeah. You know, this is supposed to be improved. No. Like that, okay? Because I'm going to fight the corruption one of a long time. No, no, that's okay. Yeah, that's no, that's that, that, no, I'm just going to have you secure. We, we, okay. to have to from this yeah, we won't be able to but fit. Tell me where I have to park, please. Um, just for the time being, right in that driveway. The driveway is the owner over there. I don't, I don't think I can do it. Just for the time being. Just tell me where I have to park the car. Okay? Because it's, it's, it's important. It's important. Okay. 
Thank you, America. Thank you. 